Thought I'd do a little video of uh, my Skywatcher EQ6 Pro carrying my old Mead 4.5 inch Mira Newtonian. Uh, I got the ZWO 294 camera in it. Currently taking a picture of M27 in my light polluted backyard. And I've been doing this for a couple hours now in the backyard. And I'm looking at my guiding is running very good. I mean, the total is 0.14, which is really good under 1.00 is considered really good and uh, so that's the image page of Nina and we can go to the sequencer page and you can see it's running M27 right now and the next one I got set up is the elephant's trunk. I set it up in Nina for M27 to start after the M13 stopped and it slewed, it centered, and it started guiding. Of course, it did a plate saw as well. So that was really working well. And the PhD is running good. And of course, you can see the graft on Nina also. But here again, it's, you know, you're looking at the TOT down there. So, uh, I'm real pleased tonight with the guiding, although the moon is like 95% illuminated and it is up uh, above the tree lines now. Uh, so, and uh, I've got um, Stellarium linked in, and what I did on Stellarium to set that up I clicked on a star and I, this is my frame of what I want to shoot next and what I did was I went to Nina I went to framing and I told it to import the coordinates from the planetarium which it did and it shows what the frame will be uh, with my telescope parameters and all that and uh, camera parameters so so far it's been doing really good tonight I've had a little trouble last night don't know what I think I just made an error in polar alignment uh, but tonight I did a polar alignment made sure I was doing it correctly and then I did a three star alignment instead of a one star alignment and uh, it's been doing good all night. So that's, uh, that's my short video of the uh, Skywatcher EQ6 Pro using my old Mead DS114 Newtonian telescope with the ZWO294 MC camera. And just finished M27 and now it's slewing and going to do a plate saw to uh, the elephant's trunk. We hope. Seems to have a little bit of trouble here. Telescope not inside tolerance, sinking telescope. Of course, if I was under darker skies, it might do better. And says it's starting to guide, so I guess it's centered up. It's probably going to be milky looking when it uh, exposes due to my light polluted skies. The skies are ranked at a Bortle 7, but it's been the only clear night I've had in two weeks. Got my dew heaters going because I live in the deep south. Got a little bit of uh, dew on items, as well as the mosquitoes are flying around. 
Well, that's one two minute exposure finished. I can't make out any nebula. A little bit of red haze, not much. Yeah, I'm gonna need dark sides for that, but I'm gonna let it run just for the practice.